Hey guys, in today's video I will show you how you can merge or cut out shapes in Affinity Designer like the ones you see right here. First of all I'm gonna plant them out so we can focus on merging or um, cutting out shapes and you can create and use any shape available in Affinity Designer. Also the ones you created yourself with for example the pen tool or pictures you use and insert it and so on. For this example, we're just creating two squares. I'm selecting the rectangle, holding down shift, clicking and holding and dragging for um, creating a perfect square. So holding down shift makes the proportions perfect. So in, for the rectangle, it's then um, made a square. For the ellipse, it's then made a circle and so on. And as a tip, you also have some more um, objects to create right here underneath uh, the uh, object you see right here by clicking on this little corner then you can select um, more shapes and you have the last one selected uh, visible to um, the, um, click on it faster than just by going through the corner right here and now I'm using this move tool and clicking command C and command V for copy pasting if you're using Windows you need to use um, um, control instead of command and I'm changing the color so we better see that these are two different um, objects and if I want to merge the shapes you can do this with as many shapes you want and with all shapes you want so like I said self-created ones and every other shapes and pictures and so on and then select them and make sure that they are converted to curves um, otherwise it might, may not work for the shapes out of the program. It works directly without converting them, but a picture, for example, you need to convert first. And then we select both of them and we just go right to the top right here and click on add. And then we see that we have a new curve, which is now created out of the two shapes. They are now merged, they are now one shape and they are a curve again. So um, I have to hold down shift to keep the proportions otherwise they are changing when using this uh, move right here. So I go on command C to go back till I have the perfect um, proportions again and for cutting out we are gonna creating a square again and a circle holding down shift to have perfect proportions and then we are giving the square a darker color so we can um, see that the circle is above the square so we have to make sure the um, shape we want to cut out is above so if the circle is would be underneath we need to um, put the layer above the layer of the shape we wanted to cut it out from and you can cut out multiple items or you can also cut out merged items or you can cut out of um, um, multiple items as uh, in one um, one step and to cut out we need to um, select both um, shapes again and then navigate to the top again and click on the minus right here next to add which is called subtract and then we see we also have a curve again and our circle is cut out of our um, square right here so we can now um, put it in the middle to view them um, next to each other what we created and that's gonna do for today's video if you um, enjoyed watching make sure to um, like and subscribe and hopefully see you in the next video and bye.